So over the time, repeated use of what? Repeated use of antibiotics converts this abscess into a cold abscess. So necrosum, you know, is a beautiful, excellent culture media and this is going to cause inflammation to the breast again and again and that is why you have recurrent periductal mastitis. Zuska's disease. Zuska's disease. What do you mean by Zuska's disease? Zuska's disease is defined as periductal mastitis, recurrent periductal mastitis. So Zuska's disease is defined as recurrent periductal mastitis due to due to chronic 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 subareolar chronic subareolar yes mastitis chronic subareolar yes mastitis now let us see the concept of this zuska's disease why this happens why this happens remember it is again associated with chronic inflammatory states so this is associated with smoking it is associated with smoking and it is associated with diabetes so smoking and diabetes are the two important reasons smoking diabetes smoking and diabetes let us see students one very important thing what is the reason so due to chronic smoking there is always a state of pan ductal inflammation and there will be definitely some collection and this lady has a habit of recurrent mastitis so she used to take over the counter some antibiotics and she never understood that actually the needles of infection is not the breast it's the smoke that is she is taking so over the time repeated use of what repeated use of antibiotics converts this abscess into a cold abscess so necrosum you know is a beautiful excellent culture media and this is going to cause inflammation to the breast again and again and that is why you have recurrent periductal mastitis and this is all because of chronic subareolar abscess because of chronic subareolar abscess and this abscess is a cold abscess so what is the classical management what is the classical management if you talk about the management if you talk about the management the management is simple simple you have to go for debridement 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 yes plus antibiotics plus antibiotics one person will say sir what will happen if i don't take the antibiotics do you know if you don't allow the pus to come out pus will itself make a tract and will come out on the surface and this will be known as a fistula so what is the concept of this fistula untreated untreated zuska's disease untreated zuska's disease will convert itself will convert itself into atkins fistula will convert itself into atkins fistula and remember the treatment of choice for fistula is not debridement it is the excision of fistula it is the excision of fistula subscribe and press the bell icon so you never miss an update from preplada